What's up, guys? Um, I got another movie review for you today. Um, this one is from Code Red, one of my favorite labels, uh, one of the best cult horror weird shit black exploitation labels. Um, this one is called Brute Core, and it is spy number fourteen. Um, Brute Core is the story of it is that there's a like a band of mercenaries that are encamped down in Mexico. And they're en route to another location to do their mission, but they're there to rendezvous and, you know, get all the preparations made and whatnot. Meanwhile, there's like a free-spirited um, hippie chick, and she's out hitchhiking across Mexico. And she encounters kind of a free-spirited dude, and they start fucking and kind of traveling together. But they're not really boyfriend and girlfriend, they're just kind of, you know, companions or whatever. So they end up crossing paths with a dude from the mercenary camp. But the dude from the mercenary camp is like this real rapey, sadistic fucking guy. And he wants the chick. And so he kind of lures him back to the camp. And it does all this weird shit happens where the mercenaries are kind of like trying to big boy and, you know, prove how tough they are. And so they end up kind of like tormenting the guy and trying to make him look bad in front of the girl and pretty soon like they just lose it and decide they're just gonna rape the chick and so then the movie kind of spirals off into this thing where they're gonna the mercenaries have to fight each other and then the winner ends up getting the girl so of course she's terrified the guy escapes and then the rest of the movie is kind of what happens you know after that and like the guy tries to go and get help from the local police but he doesn't want trouble because they're mercenaries they're armed to the teeth you know and he doesn't have any this is like a small town he doesn't have any you know manpower or firepower um the movie is really grimy really greasy um it has some really brutal scenes that i don't like in terms of like rape and physical abuse against a woman that might bother a lot of people but if you're if you've seen a lot of exploitation films it's not that graphic um try to remember the guy's name alex rocco um, you might not recognize his name, but I think you would definitely recognize his face if you saw him, if you watch a lot of movies and TV shows. He is an absolute maniac in this movie. Uh, his performance is so ridiculous. It's like, to me, David Hess is always the best kind of rape movie guy because he's such an intense, scary guy. But Alex Rocco in this one definitely gives him a run for his money. He's not quite at Hess levels, but he's pretty fucking close. He is super, super scary and super rapey. He's just a pretty fucked up guy. Um, it has a little bit of blood in it, not too much. It's got quite a bit of nudity, mostly from the same uh, girl. But, uh, you know, she's hot, so who cares? Um, it's I don't know that I would say it's a good movie. It's a Because I think a lot of people, it's it would be too dark for them. Because there's not a lot of, like, moments of brightness and happiness. Especially once the hitchhikers kind of cross paths with the, mer with the mercenaries. But I still think it's a solid movie, and if you're a fan of exploitation, um, I think it's definitely worth a look. It hasn't been the easiest movie to find over the years, so it's kind of nice that it's available now. Uh, the Blu-ray from Code Red has a new uh, HD master made from the uh, original Interpositive. And I haven't checked out the extras, uh, but it's got an audio commentary with the writer-producer, on-camera interviews and three trailers then it also has the katarina's bucket list mode if you like that i don't like the katarina stuff but i don't mind it um but that's brute core it's uh it's pretty like brutal rough exploitation uh that's definitely not for everybody but for fans of the genre i think you should definitely check it out and again that's brute core and that's spy number 14 from code red um it is a limited edition i think of a thousand so you either go to CodeRedDVD.com or you can go to uh, ScreenArchives.com. I don't think it's up at Ronin Flicks. But that's Brute Core. Uh, hopefully you liked the video, and hopefully I'll have another one up soon. Thanks, guys.